Hello my beautiful simmers and welcome back to another speed build and if you are first time here hello my name is Buena and I'm a sims 4 builder but if you are turning to my channel welcome back guys I hope you had an amazing day and like you saw already in the title um today we are building a Victorian house but this time it's not like a dark moody it's more like colorful and fun and very cute victorian house yes especially the interior but before we start i just want to thank my beautiful people who are supporting me on patreon if you didn't know i have a patreon page and um over there i'm basically like you know uh, making a posts and um sharing the tray files basically with the custom content that i use for a build if i'm building with the custom content which i usually do but um like i said if you didn't know i have a patreon and guys uh if you can you can also support me there and um so like i said let's just get back to this um video um i'm building victorian house yeah because i it's been a long time i believe since i built something and i saw this picture on pinterest it was yellow yes it was yellow i'm not so sure right now i think it was some kind of a um, art picture something like that it wasn't like um, you know the real house but it doesn't matter I love when I found something very interesting to build and since uh, I really want to use this graciously gorgeous set from Peacemaker uh, oh my god I, I, I adore this set and uh, these beautiful windows and doors are so freaking useful for any kind of build um, I use this set quite a lot you're going to see this like those windows and doors a lot um, on my channel in a couple of next weeks you know but it's going to be very fun I have a, a couple more very fun and interesting projects to share with you guys which I'm very excited about but um, this house already got the shape um, it's pretty much like maybe I don't know maybe like Queen Anne's I'm not so sure something similar but I really want it to be uh, bright and fun and something that someone may be renovated or things like that because when I'm making Victorian houses they are often very like moody and dark but for this one I just wanted to make some beautiful family house I want it to be very small Victorian house but when I'm making Victorian houses I'm, I'm not very good um, like you know making them small I'm, I'm i'm always like making them pretty much as uh, spacious but this one when it comes to the it, it has like a huge wraparound porch but the layout it's not very big like the actual floor plan it's not very big so we basically have only two bedrooms um if you have small family this could be so uh, handy and you know um, enough for like a small starter family but the bedroom is you know very decent size so you can actually put two beds if you want to uh, but when we are talking about the um, the layout and the first floor or the main floor whatever you want to call it um, it's very spacious we have like a full dining living kitchen and also bathroom when it comes to the bathrooms we also have two upstairs and two bedrooms yeah the living room is not very big but once again ah oh my god i don't know what's going on the last time because i know when i'm recording this i know the previous build was the actual coastal house 
and I'm using this set once again because I just cannot give up from this set it's so freaking useful guys you cannot understand every single time I went through the catalog I always ended up using something from Coastal Collection which is crazy because it never happens before um, I believe for me the most useful set was organic for a long time but this one I'm from Harry it's it's so freaking it's so freaking useful not to mention the last part from Clark Cat she made such a beautiful like uh, what's the name of that like Ottoman yeah that thing small for sitting someone calls that poof someone calls that like I don't know we have also some kind of very very strange name for that thing but you know what I mean and uh, also she made beautiful like a throw um, blankets and like folded ones and one for the actual bed which is so great because that was something that we actually needed uh, when it comes to the custom content not just custom content in, in the game in general but when I saw that she actually made like a throw blanket for the bed I was like yes girl that is the most amazing item I that I really needed and I'm so freaking happy because she remembered that we, we could have something um, very cute and th those kind of details are something that are very important to me when I'm building and Woodland Collection from uh, Pierre Sim is just to die for I just cannot stop using this beautiful like I don't know this thing for uh, plates and uh, cups it's so cute I love items like this um, I really wanted to combine oh my god we have three four I think four pack no pack sets over here we have coastal kitchen we have woodland from Pierisim, we have London upper cabinets from uh, Felix Andre, yes, Chalk collection from Charlie Pancakes, and a couple of items from um, I believe Chateau set. Oh my god, it's crazy! So many different um, sets, but maybe you notice, guys, the CC list is pretty short lately because I deleted some. Um, creators and some sets that I'm not going to use and they only like you know making some kind of a huge problem to me when I wanted to find the items that I really want to use that I'm using like regularly so I decided to delete a lot of things from my CC folder so I'm very happy because of that and you guys are going to be so happy because the list it's very like smaller right now you know even though i'm using everything from felix from pieric from um harry from clarket and from charlie pancakes also uh, we are going to talk about that uh, very soon because i wanted to make some kind of a video and update what i'm currently using but we are upstairs guys and we are furnishing up this parents bedroom um you can see already this kind of you know style it's very traditional with this uh, half panel half um, floral wallpaper yeah I, I really love this style and I love the colors they are so cool but you're going to see the kids bedroom very soon and I'm very proud of that bedroom because it's so freaking adorable and guys um, if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so you won't miss any of my future content this like I said is going to be on my gallery and also on my patreon page where you can also support me love you guys and see you next time bye bye